This year's regional seedings are in, and we've got them hot off the presses. Here we're highlighting the North 2 Regional, which is made up of Regions 3 and 4 traditionally. It'll be wrestled at Union High School this weekend. Let's get right into it. 106 was maybe the toughest weight to seed this season. So many young wrestlers in such a short amount of time. Here's how the top four break down. It's Livingston's Aiden Carmody at the top spot, followed by Jeffrey Jacome of South Plainfield at the second seed. North 100 and sophomore Logan Waddle is your three seed, and Daniel Jones of Del Barton comes in at the four hole. 113 pounds is another toss up. Top seeded Michael Campanero wrestled the majority of 2021 at 120 pounds and went eight and three for West Morris. Joe Sharon of Seton Hall Prep represents the Pirates in the low weights. Angelo Palicki and Jason Quirk round out the top four. Del Barton's Tyler Vasquez is one of five Green Wave wrestlers who earned a top seed in the North 2 region. As a freshman last season, Vasquez won Region 3 at 106 pounds. He'll be the favorite now at 120 as Kalen Francois, Mason Harms, and James Day all look to punch their tickets to the state tournament in Phillipsburg in two weeks. After winning a regional title a year ago at 120 pounds, Patrick Adams of St. Peter's Prep earns the top seed at 126. He's 7-1 this season. Del Barton sophomore Cross Wazalewski earns the number two seed. Chris Tringali of Mendham comes in with the three seed. North 100 and senior Frank Dieso looks to fight for a spot in Phillipsburg from the four seed. Del Barton's Nico Nardone has brought his game to another level in 2021. Nardone gets the top seed here at 132 pounds and won regions last year at 126. He'll have the target on his back. Sean Renderio of St. Peter's Prep earns the two seed. Brerley's Patrick Phillips slides in as the number three seed. And the fourth seed in this bracket goes to Hanover Park's Dom Marola, who sits at nine and two coming into this tournament. Reigning state champion Joey Oliveri is back to defend his gold this year. Oliveri from Hanover Park won regions and states a year ago at 132 pounds and is now the top dog at 138. Who will be gunning for him? Two seed Justin Cantor of North Bergen, three seed Josiah Queen from Elizabeth, and number four seed Giovanni Rivera hailing from Morristown. 145 pounds as one of the most competitive brackets in the North 2 Regional. Del Barton sophomore Simon Ruiz has been excellent this season, and he draws the number one seed. Ruiz placed third in states at 132 last season. South Plainfield hammer Anthony White won his region at 132 last year and finished fourth in that weight behind Ruiz, and he gets the number two seed here. That could be one incredible regional final. Alex Martinez from Bound Brook has the third seed at 145, and at number four is Scotch Plains Fanwood senior Brandon Bowles. Buckle it up here. Del Barton Jr. Andrew Troshinsky looks to become a repeat regional champion in 2021. He captured gold in Region 3 last year and finished second in the state at 145. Looking to knock him off his perch here at 152 will be Seton Hall Prep's Cole Carroll, Owen Disbro from St. Thomas Aquinas at the three seed, and Cranford's Colin Murray. 160 pounds is one of the rare North 2 regional brackets without a non-public wrestler in the top four. Watchung Hills' Blake Bonna looks to repeat as a region champ this season, but faces a stiff test as the number three seed. Rutgers commit Dylan Weaver of Lindhurst is the top seed, followed by Bridgewater Raritans' Nick Sacco. Josh Palacio represents North Bergen from the four seed. Del Barton's command of the top seeds in this region extend well into the 170 pound weight class. Junior Colin Calvetti sits atop the bracket here and looks to win a regional after finishing second at 152 a year ago. North Hunterin's James Holder is your second seed here, Nutley's Salvatore Minero and Livingston's Stratos Cantanas are the three and four seeds respectively. Someone in the North 2 region's 182 pound bracket will be a first time regional champ. Connor Decker will represent Seton Hall Prep as the top seed, followed by fellow Essex County grappler 
Zachary Andrukowitz from Bloomfield as the two seed. Del Barton's Nick Oliveri is your three seed, and Alex Erniak of North Hunterdon comes in at the number four spot. We've got some heavy hitters at 195 pounds. Strap up that headgear. South Plainfield gets a top-seeded wrestler in the form of Thomas Renna. Renna aims to win back-to-back -back regional championships this weekend. And it'll be no walk in the park. Daniel Pereira is West Orange's highest seed this year. Jack Wild from Seton Hall Prep earned the three seed. And Robert Lerner, another Scotch Plains Fanwood representative, is the four seed. The 220-pound bracket would have belonged to Del Barton's P.J. Casal, but with him now opted out of the state tournament, it's anyone's game. Cliffside Park product Jacob Levia draws the top seed, followed by Columbia's Tyson Carroll at two, Nutley's Nick Ploweka at three, and Bayonne's Keith Simon at number four. North Hunterdon's program has lived up to the hype with the amount of wrestlers in this region. Liam Akers looks to turn his third place region finish from a year ago into a first place win at heavyweight. Another name to watch out for is Justin Evans Jenkins from Irvington, a top tier power five football recruit. He has potential here. Tyler McCatherine of Warren Hills drew the two seed and Charles Searle from Nutley is your fourth seed.